and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for a deck we're calling Mirror Mage Watcher. This is going to be a new version of Lissandra Trundle. I'm sure you've seen Shadow Isles Lissandra Trundle quite a bit. This is going to be with Bandle City with Lissandra Trundle. We're going to have some different created cards in just the early game that Bandle City provides. But then in the top end, we're going to have Mirror Mage to go along with our Lissandra Trundle. And the reason why is one, Mirror Mage costs 8 mana, which is the perfect amount of mana for Lissandra and for the Watcher. But then two, whenever we play our, our created followers, we get an exact copy. So therefore, Ice Pillar. We If we have a Mirror Mage in play, then we play Ice Pillar. Now we make another Ice Pillar. So we get two of them. And so, you know, like that really helps you know, level up your Lissandra, of course, but then also helps get you to your five, eight plus cost cards that you need for the Watcher. Um, you know, so that's kind of like what we're thinking here. And then, of course, if we have a Mirror Mage in play and eventually whenever we get to the Watcher, we can play the Watcher, we get an additional copy because of, um, you know, because of Mirror Mage. And so we have two 1117s that are chilling there attacking and everything that could be pretty cool so that's that's kind of what we got going on here so is that a little slow is that a little meme tier absolutely but that's what we got here for meme tier tuesday it's mirror mage watcher time let's go ahead and get to some games we're gonna head on over to normal and we're playing five games over there we had zoe nami up first zoe nami always a difficult matchup unfortunately we don't have loping telescopes that could make we're going to keep this hand, though. We don't have loping telescopes that can make Equinox. Hmm. This is tough. I'm going to go plus two cost to the line mob. You know, we want to mess up their ability to... Uh, you know, round three, play something. And level up the Nami. And so, yeah, they're going with the Sparkle Fly right away, which that's not a, a good way to level up Nami. Perfect. Alright, we're... Messing up their ability to level up not me. Which I See what else we got. Poro snacks? I don't think that really works. I guess we could caught in the cold. They always have prote different protection spells. Attack of the Otterpus. At least we have like all the information in the game. All right, so we want to let that happen. So then the buff goes over there. Now we kill that thing. Yes, Mirror Mage. Punish transgressions. Uh, I guess I'm blocking. This 
this thing's at four out of seven. I definitely want to just mini morph Nami. Maybe we don't do that yet. Maybe we do that next round. Because if I do that, then they get to attack like with this 3-3. Three, three. Also, maybe we get this 4-5 regen in play. They're not doing a great job leveling up, Nami. I'll knock him dead. The guilty were banned. Four mana is a lot of mana for a king. I'm gonna hold this prank until we play Mirror Mage later. So we get to double again, yeah, so we get to cast it twice. These pranks have really kind of messed up my opponent. Yeah, so they spent five mana to kill an otter puss there. <laughs> All right, enough Nami stuff. Yeah, opponent didn't do a very good job of, for leveling up Nami. They didn't have Nami right away, and so they were playing like their Sparkle Flies right away instead of faking spell mana. And then they drew Nami, and then they're like, "Whoa, I haven't faked spell mana yet." They're just kind of one of those kind of things. I don't really know how they do two damage with two mana as far as me blocking the 3 3 goes. But I don't exactly want to risk it. Smashing. Double parlay. That's not good. They drew another Nami. That's not good. Astounding curiosities lie ahead. The bad part with Lissandra is this frozen thrall takes up board space that I really don't want to take up. Bad thing here. It's 
So I play Lissandra, that's four spots. Then we play Mirror Mage, that's five spots. So then whenever we play Ice Pillar, we don't have room for the next thing. So I'm thinking maybe we don't even play Lissandra. Yeah, Alessandra doesn't block the elusives, but it could... Ooh, okay, okay. Alright, so let's just mini-morph the Shelly, right? Because it's an elusive. Man, but we're so slow now. Maybe I just have to... We have to just admit we... No. No, 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 no. Because if we go mini morph this round, then I'm playing Mirror Mage the next round, and then it's another round until I play Ice Pillar. But I think we're going to we're gonna want to have Ice Pillar next round for the Trundle. Oh. We may just have to admit that we can't Mirror Mage, basically. If that's the case, then we can do this. The reason not to Ice Pillar... Is because I wanted to have Mirror Mage to play before Ice Pillar so we get multiple Ice Pillars. Let the tide carry you. And if, if we Ice Pillar, they kill Ice... You know, like they can... Threaten killing Ice Pillar. Be a problem. Wow. All right. Well. Yeah, that's pretty good. All right, Nami's still good. Nami's still good. Because I need that Ice Pillar to get vulnerable for, for me to challenge the next round, but... Nami's still a good card. Maybe I had to mini morph Nami. If I mini morph Nami, they get a couple of plus one plus ones to everything. I probably had to mini morph Nami. It was looking good once we got rid of the first Nami, but then they had a second. And so, with the, all those elusives, it's just a little, just a little too fast for me. I'm trying to set up Mirror Mage. So if I would have played Lissandra like that other round, and then, and not worried about like getting Mirror Mage value, then I would have been able to play Ice Pillar and then Mirror Mage, and then we would have had Tough Nexus and a lot more blockers. This is, that's what I had to do. I did not be so greedy. I put it in your hat this morning. I am inevitable. So Avalanche doesn't get through spell shield. A Blighter Ravine does get through spell shield. Mama's home. But I want to do this right now before they get more. Hungry, hungry owl cats. That hurts. Their 
having left? <laughs> So we could pokey stick the one one fury to try to have them play the other hungry hungry owl cap. I'm gonna do that. I kind of think they're going to play it. Cool. Because with these things having the spell shield, I do want to get rid of them. And that's what the ravine can do. We only killed like two cards because <laughs> all those other things were free. we need to prank. I'm gonna waste mana here. Let's go ahead and play this thing. Um, let's grab a shared spoils. Oh! That's enabled right now? Well, I should probably just cast it right now. Maybe it should just be passing priority. Many tribes under one banner. Jealous. I want Avros and Hearthgarden. I guess Purpleberry Shake for Lissandra. Three two. I liked that thing better as a two one. Mirror Mage. No. Let's take this outside. Off. 
Hmm. Now I wish I would have used the purple bear shake. Now that we have a tavern keeper. I don't think that Trixie Tentacles is too necessary. We'll just grab this thing. So this is this Pokey Stick was created, so I want to save this. We're gonna use the non-created Pokey Stick. I wanna save the created one to see if we have a mirror mage. Which I guess I should have played this first. So that if we did have mirror mage right here, we would have been able to play it. Frozen Thrall's almost uh, almost counted down already. So they're Teemo and Poppy. We have to imagine they just have all these spells over there, considering they're not playing any other units out. But maybe they're worried about an AoE spell. I'm not sure. I just know the heroes around here somewhere. Alright, so we can. Let's see, we can Entomb Poppy, or Lissandra's Entomb. I think that's my best course of action right now. I don't really want to throw the Ice Pillar down and let them challenge kill the Ice Pillar, plus, you know, we're, we have a full board. Could definitely use Mirror Mage. This is a heck of a Curious Shell Folk hand, also, if we had Curious Shell Folk. Or I guess it would have been before we start creating all the things. I mean, I can heal Lissandra, but that only goes to four tough. Alright, there's the mirror mage.
I want to be able to play two ice pillars. Uh, we, of course, going to need some things to die before that's a possibility, but I'm going to want to play two ice pillars uh, to, to get to Watcher, right? Because we need five eight drops for Watcher. That's not easy. If I go Ice Pillar first, then Mirror Mage, then we're sitting at three, and it's going to be really tough to get to five. Um, it's, you know, obviously that's better with Trundle leveling up, and we would make the Hearth Guard vulnerable. But it's going to be pretty tough still. Okay, I do not want you to play that card. So I think it costs nine now. 11, 13. Oh, really? You don't even let me make that thing cost 15? Oh, that's... Oh, they won't, they won't let it go over 13. Oh... I was going to make it cost 15, so then they can't even cast it ever. Not allowed. Korok says it can go to 14, so yeah, if it, like if it was exactly 12, we could still do it. But once it costs 13, you can't do it anymore. Stand and defend! Alright, I of course need the room. It's not leveled up yet. My shield is yours. Something to reflect upon. Simply. Oh, this is a created Lissandra? Yo, we can have double tough. Wait, 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 we can have double tough? Is that a thing? Double tough nexus? <laughs> I should probably play Conchologist though and create a spell. So you can see if they're gonna rally. What I'm worried about, because mm, I play Conchologist that's four, then I play like one Lissandra and it makes the, the stupid thrall thing, and then the second Lissandra just gets buried. Like two fleeting ice shards? Yeah, so we're going to do this. I don't want my second Lissandra to get buried. Wait, why am I not making another? Followers, not champions. Right, right. Oh, well. Okay, how much damage are we taking here? Not like that much. Like, a, basically, like, do I have to Tavern Keeper right now? Or we could, we could probably wait. We'll probably do this first. So maybe we get a, a nice flash freeze? Yeah. Man, I thought I was going to be making two uh, ice shards at, like, round start. I was all excited. Kill. Kill. 
All right, we need one more eight drop somehow so we can get double watcher. And <laughs> now it's just going to make them discard the 13 mana that Yordles in arms. I, I would have done all that work for nothing. Nothing escapes my watch. Yeah, winning with Ice Shard is kind of the plan. That's definitely part of the plan. It does kill this 3-3. It kills that and that. Oh, there are two of them! Oh, that gets close to killing Mirror Mage. Stinging Alright, cool. That'll do, because then, you know, round start, we're going to create another Ice Shard. And they're now at one. So, almost got to Double Watcher, but we killed our opponent too fast. I tried. I wanted to watch her. Zareth Azir. So we got a buried or a yeah, buried sun disk deck. These all look like keeps. Keepsies. Oh, I was gonna prank the sun disk. I'll make it cost two more or something. Uh, we'll go minus two power on the devout. No, maybe I just maybe I just make that a one one that can't block. I don't know. I don't love either of those pranks. Border from here. Go get the shiny dub. Watch your head. So I'm planning on just taking damage from this thing every single round. And, you know, eventually, you know, it's just going to hurt their board space, basically. So now they have, like, one spot taken up with the Sun Disk, one spot taken up with this Treasure Seeker. They can't block. I love all these Kindly Tavern Keepers. They don't really do anything. Yeah, especially when in, in, in an escaped devout world. Huh. Three Sisters is the best card, but we already have a Three Sisters, and maybe Spoils of War. Maybe we can get plus two, plus four on this. Ready the torches. Lissandra. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. If they had ten cards, we'd make them burn one and then discard one. I thought 
Hmm. Alright. They may have another one of these to blow up the frozen thrall. Sing me the song of the rock tools. Come on in. Oh, we got big Lissandra. Ambassador was their most expensive card. We live in hollow times. Huh. So they could have just drawn a Zareth that has plus two, plus two, and so we're going to lead with this other aloof travelers and try to make them discard that Zareth. It could, of course, be an Azir as well. We don't know. I was hoping that they would just pass, keep nine cards in hand so that for turn they draw a tenth, and then, you know, we get like, you know, whenever they have ten cards, you get the double whammy of burn plus discard. We're not quite that lucky. We could play Kundal, but... Alright, cool, it was Zareth. Good, got him to burn the Zareth. <laughs> yeah, this is this is a cluster right here. Board space cluster. Let's talk about your. Nothing's tougher than a troll. We cannot fight the codes. All right, we got him to destroy me in a gem. You will do as I command. Mirror Mage. Gonna catch the sky. I've got meat bigger than you.
Yeah, hopefully we can play Watcher. I'm hoping. Okay, so, yeah, Mirror Mage is going to be number four. Yeah, and I'm sorry, Mirror Mage, you're going to be, you're going to be vulnerable. Hope you don't mind too much. And then, so we'll have four things in play. And then we get double Ice Pillar. Yeah, more removal. We're going to have to find a new Lissandra now. Do this real quick. They're they're at thirteen. Pressures them pretty good. Alright, so that is 18 Overwhelm right now. I think that should just kill them. So we didn't get to... Like, we would have been able to watch her if they didn't kill my Lissandra. But they killed the Lissandra, unfortunately. But we'll take the W. Mirror Mage, Ice Pillar. Sedition. Double it up. Because, yeah, they could, they could have Quicksand, and then Quicksand this Trundle and block. And then they're only taking 12, but of course we have ways to get more damage across. Faithless creature. Well, we... Sedition. Yeah. You dare. Alright, we have... We can either... Let's go Fury of the North. We could, we could, you know, mini morph our own Ice Pillar here. We're gonna go Fury because then it's a created card uh, that gets doubled up by Mirror Mage, so we have to double Fury. You can't take this crown. And we're two and one. Oh, you think we should have won with Blighted Ravine? Yeah, that would have been pretty cool too. And darkness control. Hope we have enough removal for their champions. Only have the two mini morphs. Like I don't even know if it's like worth keeping Otterpus. Like what's Otterpus gonna do in this matchup? Besides a whole bunch of nothing. Right, help out hidden pathways. Hidden pathways good. What? Is that four champs? Oh, uh, mini morph targets enemies only? You can't mini morph your own stuff? 
That's lame. Yeah, is that four champs over there? With our crystals combined. <laughs> Great top decks. All right, Acolyte into Catalyzer, like exactly the, the cards you want early on. Okay, mini morphs any unit. Okay, you can mini morph your own stuff. Cool, that's how it should be. Again, the frozen thrall started. Good, my father's friend. I totally understood that. We're gonna need that probably to kill Vagar, but man, Vagar, this is. Probably not good for me. Yeah, it's about to be four damage. This is not good. It's not too good at all. Mirror Mage. Keep your distance. Nothing's tougher than a troll. That's four. Well, that didn't work out. Because either I... If I Fury of the North, they still have Darkness. If I Flash Freeze, they still have Darkness. I could force them to, to play the Darkness, though, instead of holding it.
Turn it against them. Oh dear. Hmm. We know they have more champions in hand. That's, that's the problem. Besides all the other problems that we have, that's definitely one of the problems. It's even more champions. Uh, what's up, Yext? Man, I want to play. I really want to play Mirror Mage and get Mirror Mage in play. Alright, chat's just saying just play the Ice Pillar. We have another trundle to make another Ice Pillar. Because I think they play another Senna if I kill this Senna. It's our best play as long as it doesn't get like mini morphed and stuff like that. Or killed with something like that. And it was the backup center. And it's never done. Darkness and light. These old eyes still see far and clear. Getting dark. Yeah, I could have bouncing bombed and killed this Senna, but then they would have been able to play the other Senna. I don't know, this isn't... Um, yeah. As that happens, that just gives them, yeah, gives them another darkness. Why even do that? I don't. I don't understand. I don't understand this play right here. I don't understand that play, really at all. They really wanted that one-one in play, I guess. Yeah, if they had a miss call, I guess. They didn't they didn't play miss call, but yeah, I guess that would have made sense. Miss call. Turn it 
Turn it against them. What will you have? Kill the Senna. And we're keeping Trundle alive. We're doing some stuff. I need some work done. Maybe it's better at Bouncing Bomb. I wanted to play this to draw a card, right? Like, I want to get an additional card into the deck. Oh, that would have been nice to have that stress defense instead of using the Fury of the North. Avalanche. Okay, okay. We are doing some stuff. I guess Vagar is going to be leveled up also. I was thinking that we could... Okay, yeah. I'm seeing we could avalanche plus bouncing bomb. A dark looms on the horizon. Oh, you're saying that I should have, instead of doing the Fury of the North or the Trundle, I should have entombed my own Trundle so that it would come back in two rounds and then summon another ice pillar. Can a spirit fight to the death? Thinking I'll learn soon. That wouldn't be a bad idea. See the Demacian border from here. This I look right fit. All right, how are we doing on eight drops? That's the fourth eight drop. Whoa, we're so close. We're so close. You're no three. We're so close. We need to draw a mirror mage. We're gonna avalanche here, draw a card of the century, hopefully draw a mirror mage. And then we get to play mirror mage. And then we can have double watcher. Dapos with the donation deck. Thank you very much. I'll write that down after this. Withering Mist, Drain 2 from both of them. Uh, what do we draw? We, we drew a three sisters. Okay, this could be... Entomb... We could Entomb, you know, our Trundle if we want to do that. Yeah. Get another... This, this could, or, you know, it's either that or the stress defense. Come on, come on. Um. Maybe just stress defense. Alright. That will work. And we'll take our three and one record. Uh, 
All right, go hard burn with catalog. All right, cool. Catalog go hard. Good. Um, somebody wanted me to build a catalog go hard deck, so now we have one to play. All right, writing, writing it down. Would you like it in ranked or in normal for meme tier? Which which one would you like it? Also, would you like me to play the exact list that you have, or do you want me to, uh, you know, take a look at it and see if there's anything to improve before playing? If you've been playing it a lot, then you know we'll probably play. We'll probably just play your exact list. All right, ranked, and it's worked well for you. All right, so we will keep your exact list and we'll play it in ranked. Catalog go hard deck. Awesome. Thank you. All right, what do we have here? Hecarim, Callista, Maokai. The classic combination. Let me keep my hand. Okay, really cool. All right, it was a seasonal tournament deck. Win six and three with it. hand for me right now. We're wasting a little bit more mana. I guess we'll make this Haunted Relic cost more. They Haunted Relic, I Avalanche. I'm just kind of trade one for one there, but I guess I also lose my 1-1. One, one. Maybe it's not really that necessary. Maybe I should just be taking it, but that's a lot of... Saves me six life, basically, if I'd have my 1-1 one, one block a shark. That's actually pretty awesome, Grant. Can't block to the weakest enemy. Cause now, like, they can just have like my Trundle not be able to block if I just if I lead Trundle next round. That's that's actually pretty awesome. That's actually that's actually a problem. Maybe at four mana, it's the most expensive card for our Loof Travelers. Let's see what's out there. I don't know, I kind of feel like we need to draw another card and... Man overboard. <laughs> yeah, I think they're playing a harrowing deck, that, that would make sense. Because even, like, I'd go Aloof Traveler's next round and they say Aloof Traveler can't block. That's actually really powerful. Hmm. I, sh I need to keep my 1-1 one -one alive, didn't I? That's what I'm looking for here. I'm looking for like another otter puss with playing that pokey stick. Nami Taric gem deck is strong, but unfortunately you only ever see starfish. Nami gems. Wow, we got another Otter Puss. That's fairly lucky. Of 
So we could have either drawn that or the trinket trade. Like we had a trinket trade earlier. We made it. Yay. But our stuff did it. Looks like we drew both of them. Yeah, I think the opponent may be gone. That's too bad. This was a good game. They had a good setup and everything. I think I I don't think they like quit like rage quit or anything. I think they like got disconnected. Kind of thing. That's too bad. Maybe they show back up. Like maybe they're trying to reconnect here. I'll give them a chance. Okay, they're back. Alright, now we can play again. Let's go with... Let's plus two cost that one. So last breath creates that thing. The Isles will bloom again. play black spear yeah they shouldn't have they should not have attacked with this 3-3 three, three. so they could have they look angry. Uh... Ready the torches. So then... oh, okay so that goes back to their hand that's not just it's not summoned it's create one of those in hand okay I'll take out something. Light the signal fire. Well, I was lucky. Astounding curiosities lie ahead. Oh, they just had another one. Trundle still bites the dust. We need a BRB emote. They don't have the attack token this round, right? The trolls are going to war. It's kind of surprising they're playing that right now, isn't it? Lovely day for a battle. Oh, that card good. I'll knock them dead. Okay, you think they're setting up harrowing? 
That would make sense. I did make them discard one harrowing earlier with the aloof travelers. But I, we can assume that they play more than one. Well, you wouldn't really play that if you had harrowing. something the camp block yeah I'm gonna have to I'm probably gonna have to um you know use this thing to get rid of the Neverglade collector uh, of course the second collector is not great for me at least block everything I don't think we're dead. They never they have two sharks, don't they? I think they must not realize they have two sharks. So that card doesn't do anything. We don't know what the other card is. Maybe they just don't attack with this thing. Like, they could be attacking with more sharks. Alright, so we still go to three either way. We'll deny them drawing the cards. Do 20 damage. That's it. No biggie. Ooh, tough Nexus. Tough Nexus, we can heal our Nexus 4. We can also mini morph this thing. So it stops doing all the stuff it does. Yeah, but the Tough Nexus stops the um, Neverglade Collector over here. That's important. Kind of killing a whole bunch of stuff of mine. That's fine. Cool. 
Because I don't think these... I don't think these thing, these collectors do anything anymore. Right? Yeah. They don't even heal their Nexus any. So it's, this thing's a problem turning into an ephemeral. Like, that's kind of a problem. And saying stuff can't block. That's kind of a problem. This thing costs nine? That's a lot of mana. I don't know why I didn't do this at the same time also. That's kind of my plan, but I just didn't cast it. With the others. Alright, GG's. Whoops, did I break something? GG's. Lissandra pretty good. We just need a bunch of Lissandras and Entombs. Um, but there we go. That was Mirror Mage Watcher. Now, we didn't get to play Watcher, unfortunately. Man, it's it's tough. That that fifth one that you need, you know, we had Watcher a couple of times with four. Or our opponents conceded before we could play Watcher, or we kill him, you know, otherwise by attacking and stuff before we could play Watcher. It's, it's difficult playing the Watcher, but pretty cool little deck here. You know, like, this is just some good Bandle cards, right? Mini Morph's amazing. Then you have Aloof Traveler's. Conchologist, Trinket Trade, Otter Post, like these are all just amazing cards. Freljord's a very good region for these manifesting the other three or less cost spells. There's tons of great spells in Freljord uh, to manifest. And you got some decent card draw with those Pokey Sticks and Avaros and Sentries, how those kind of get you in. And you know, you have the pathways if you need it to. Just, I think this is a good, you know, Bandle City is just kind of one of the best regions. And so pairing it, you know, you have your Lissandra Trundle uh, combination, which we know those two champions work really well together. But instead of going to Shadow Isles, Bandle City is just kind of a better region these days. So the deck looked really good. It looked very good there. Yeah, and Aloof Traveler's drawing you extra cards too. So you got card advantage there as well. And then, you know, you got, you got your uh, Nexus Healing, which is definitely important with your Tavern Keepers. And Blighted Ravines, and uh, and then you know you have like Frostbite also. So besides Mini Morph being able to take down any anything, if there's other big overwhelms or you know something you have to, you have like the flexibility with Three Sisters and Frostbite, and of course you can make other Frostbites with Conchologist or Trinket Trade as well. So you kind of have a little bit of everything. All right, but that's gonna be Mirror Mage Watcher. So those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button. And as always, leave those comments. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this. If you're a fan of Lissandra or Trundle and wanna do something new, something fresh besides uh, just old Shadow Wiles, Lissandra Trundle, definitely give this list a try and let me know how y'all like it. Hopefully y'all are enjoying it. But that's gonna be it for this one. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you for the next video.